Incoming! Good morning, welcome to DDO Wiki Talk. I am your host, Technical13, aka Shoemaker. I'm gonna refill my cup of coffee and we can get started making some edits to DDO Wiki. I have no idea what we're gonna work on this week. Love to get some suggestions. Please feel free to type them in chat on either my personal technical underscore 13 channel or on the DDO stream channel. I am watching both chats. DDO stream channel chat is on screen. You may wish to join me in Discord. Discord.me slash the shoe store. Hate coffee. That's just because you're not making it correctly. You need to get yourself some some cap de luck. Some nice cat poop coffee. Good stuff. See, when I drink iced coffee, I drink it black. No milk, no sugar. I don't even put ice in it. Maybe one ice cube. When I drink it hot, I do one sugar per ounce and one cream for every four or five ounces. So if it's a 20 ounce cup of coffee, that's 20 sugars, five creams. Music's a little bit loud in my ears, so I'm gonna adjust that. There we go, that's a little better. Let's take a look at our recent changes. We'll start there, as we do every week. Excellent.
All right, let's scroll to the bottom. Start at the beginning. We got uh, spare hand work. Some monster work. I did some work to Habitat Phantom, an image pop-up. I created bonus and penalty. Very loosely defined words. Spam block got a little bit of work done to it. It now will post a, um, a spam block template on the talk page of whoever was blocked. Some new items. Some of the plus three Temple of Elements legal stuff, I believe. Carthy Cave. Some NPC adjustments, favor stuff, prices confirmed with Haggle Zero character. Hoping to find something on a talk page. Oh, I did some welcoming. I went through the, the active users list and found anybody that had made edits that weren't spam. Posted to their page. Spell usefulness. Oh, well, that's a talk page there. We can see what was added there. Giant hold tour. No direction for quest completion. We'll take a look at that. I might adjust the way that it tags the page with spam block. I'm not sure that I really like the edit summary that much. Might modify that a little bit. Let's see here. Talk Fear Factor. We'll take a look at that one. I want to see what was said or asked for there. Quick sneeze. Uh, there we go. Stuff there to patrol and we're caught up all right let's see here suggestion here my spell usefulness well, they didn't sign their post, so we need to do a, a signature. No am in no am in EO. No am in EO. No am in EO date equal. Subst unsigned
show changes. Shots per inch. That puts the code in there properly, good. Excellent. Wait a minute, why did it break alone? 2014, it was probably using post. Uh, did he double sign? Double sign for some reason. Yes, Titan. Dots per inch. No, there's no walkthrough for Giant Hold Tour. It's pretty linear, isn't it? You go in, you follow the path, killing stuff, get to the end, and you're done. But. You want to add a walkthrough? Go for it. Ah, rusty pipes. Apparently have a strength requirement to break. I've never seen that, so I don't know. I think there are a couple pipes that have a requirement, but most of them don't. Alrighty, so that gets us all caught up. Let's take a look at our special pages and see if there's any work to do there. I wonder if wanted pages got cleaned up any over the course of the week. Why are they all still showing up? Wait, named armor shown Judge APG?
When's the next Champion Hunter weekend? That would be a great question to ask Quarter Van tomorrow. And he's probably going to say he has no idea. Well, we can dump that. There's no page for cosmetics? Cosmetic armor, maybe? Medic armor kits. Which are improperly named. Should be lowercase for armor and kits, but whatever. Tails up, huh? So I'll take care of that one. Blackwidow.png. Tangleroot Gorge. So it's all being brought in by the monsters template. Monsters in. Oh, so, Tangleroot Gorge. Monsters in Tangle Root Gorge. Where's Monsters in Tangle Root there? Which is populated by the template. Monsters in Quest. Which is populated by the Phantom. If exist file.
blackwidow.png But the image is there, so why is it saying it's not there? It's missing the file prefix. That's why. Okay. What if I do... Just out of curiosity. Special upload. WP dust file. works. That's not the issue. It exists. I don't know why it does that. File exists, then file image view for the text. Otherwise, no pick. Two. If image is empty, no pick. If exists, file image, then use file image. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I think I know what it is. A uh, new window. This file image. Then file. Well, no, that's not right. It automatically puts that in. 
Wait a minute, why is this one file? Here, rather. Let's see what happens. Tango Root Gorge. Crush it. Tango Root Gorge go away. No. Oh well. I give up on that project. I have no idea. Welcome to voice chat, Titan. Patch 2 should be out soon, I believe. Um, any suggestions, people, for what you would like to see me edit? I can hear you, Titan. I'm using two headsets at the same time. Okay. Adjust my mic sensitivity a little bit. All right. Oh, I guess we can leave that alone. Why does one of your Discord bots show as streaming? Streaming? What do you mean? Like, uh, like, Cobalt Worker has a purple dot. Yep. And when you click on it, what does it say? The host of Tentacle 13? Yep. So it's streaming a host. It's an actual link to the stream. They all say that right now, actually. Except for Signal. Which is a different type of bot. Live on Twitch. So you can click on it and it will take you to the stream. Why does it say that? Because I told it to say that. When you're streaming, I believe that you can tell it to host you as well. And that way, any channel that has COBOL Worker in it will see that it's hosting you, and they'll check out your stream. I 
make that go away for a second. Back up. Oh, I need to get magnifier. 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 I wish it wasn't... Shoot, is the earth on fire? Because I'm seeing a lot of smoke outside. Not that I know of. I don't know why magnifier is stuck like that. Ah, that's why. I must not be using an arrow theme. Okay. Let me see if I can fix that. Come on. Waiting for my mouse to catch up. Personalize. There, now I should be using a, a narrow theme. Apparently I'm not.
Looks like I'm gonna have to fix my desktop. Turning on magnifier kind of like broke stuff. Why is it docked? I don't know. Whatever. I guess I can't use magnifier. I'll have to find a better program for that. Alright, so... Find something to edit on the wiki. Do people want to do some more graphic editing this week? That could be fun, I guess. Graphics, DDO, update 36 stuff. Yeah, I can't wait to see, uh, Claire domains. Yeah, it I heard it might be up on Lemania later this week. Yeah, poor event said. Maybe. Only if Titan doesn't nag him too much or something like that. No. That's what I heard. Accurate. Accurate information. Alright, so... I was gathering some screenshots... For monsters. Orum Agent. That's in uh, Vaughn 5. Yes, it is. 
shrink that down. Let's go to forum agent. Forum agent. The Vault of Night. Don't have a lot of information on them, do we? So let's see here. They are CR 45 on Epic Elite. CR. XP colors. Norm. Hard. Elite. Enorm. E hard. So I was I heard on Sarlona that there was a piker that was better than better than Chu. Yeah, his name is Titan. He's even better than, you know Elminster. What you're saying? Yeah, he's got about nine thousand hit points. No, I only do that in DDO. Elements are pikes in Neverwinter as well. Hmm. Looks like the beneficial and the negative buff icons are all in the same area. Let's look at the combat log. Ooh, takes wisdom damage. Take sneak attack damage. Uh, hit me for pierce damage. So uses pierce. Looks like Hurricane okay. Irma was just upgraded to a five. Is it going to become a six? I don't think a six is. What's the definition of a five? Yeah, what's the definition of it? Good morning, Ed. Welcome to the show. Good morning, Ed. Nerve. Um, category is the strength of it. Yep. Based on what? speed okay so what is the range for wind speeds for category five um i think they said for irma uh it was at 175 okay so, I'll tell you that it's 180 miles an hour for Category 5 is where it starts. So you're saying it's not a Category 5 yet? So if it starts at 180, what is the top of, of, of top wind speed for Hurricane 5? I believe it's either 220 or 240. What happens if it goes over that? It becomes Category 6. Category 6 doesn't exist yet in the scale. They'll have to add it. Or 
Storm Soldier. What do we got here? CR 45, Dwarf. Um, doesn't have a CR in there. Norm, normal, I think actually. Hard, elite, normal. Should go back and fix the other one. E hard, E elite, forty five. It is a stub. Can't really take a good picture of him there. Bird is Sentinel, so that's a different one. Okay. Oop. XP color. Oh, it should be XP colors. I missed the S what I get for not having my enough morning coffee. Some changes. Agent. <clears throat> Norm. No. Normal. Normal. Okay, next one is Subverted Sentinel. Subverted Sentinel. Edit. CR XP colors normal hard beat e normal e hard e elite forty six It's like DR is five, regardless of the difficulty. Chaotic neutral, huh? We got oh, yes, subverted drone. Piker must have died. Iron Defender's Sheet Toughness has been removed from Piker. Iron Defender's Augmented Summons Effect has been removed from Piker. Iron Defender's Improved Augment Summon Effect has been removed from Piker. Iron Defender's Elysium Summons Effect has been removed from Piker. Iron Defender's Epic Summon Effect has been removed. Iron Defender's Able Effect has been removed. Your DR30 Epic Effect has been removed from Piker. Piker died. Poor Piker. My Iron Defender. Still Pike's less than Titan. Oh. <laughs> Alright. I did Titan. 
So type is living construct, warforged, warforged, chaotic neutral. I don't get anything extra from that. Okay. I said even my iron defender pikes less than you. Spurred a drone. It's all right, Titan. It's okay to be a piker. I know people that have completed triple completionist as a piker. Now that is a feat in of itself. Yes, but can you pike in two games at once? Absolutely. I don't know if this will work or not, but it should. And if it doesn't, we're going to make it work. Make it work. Yeah, it doesn't. Okay. We're going to edit the DR template and make it work. Normal. Boom. So we're going to do normal, hard, elite. Excellent. We're gonna get rid of that one. I'm gonna do solo and casual separately. Okay, so invulnerability. Fault, pop up, damage reduction. Two is damage reduction. One, zero. Okay, so one or This is where it gets tricky. Issue, does your Discord mic have a uh, reduced background noise feature? Nope. I just have the threshold so that it doesn't trigger unless I'm actually talking. Normal. Hard. Delete. Those are all empty. Then zero, otherwise XP colors, normal, hard, beat.
normal. Copy, paste, copy, paste, copy, paste, copy, paste, copy, paste. Okay, so chop that out. Get rid of those. So if I replace the one with that. Issue, is Strimtown still in the uh, Players Council? As far as I know. Pipe, 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 back, pipe, pipe, pipe. Doesn't quite work. Oh, that's why. Okay. That might be even better. I think I got it all. We'll find out in a second. There we go.
I gotta fix that part still. God, this code is hard to read. <sighs> Let's break it out so I can read it. It's getting too complicated to read. I really don't care about invulnerability, it, it doesn't change any. Okay, so what I need to do is I need to see if there's a switch for XP colors to get rid of the pop-ups. And there isn't. And it's going to be a lot of work for me to be able to switch that out at this point. Wait a minute, is it part of pop-up? Maybe it won't be that hard.
Nothing there. Okay. Okay, so it just repeats that over and over and over again, right? One for each difficulty. I could build... an array... I could build two arrays, one with the list of colors. I could build some arrays and loops. Although I think it would complicate the code more than clean it up. I'll have to break this code apart. It's going to be a multi-hour project for me to re revamp this. So what I'm going to do for the meantime is for the DR template, I'm simply going to get rid of the pop-up. Eight. If equals one. XP colors. I'm going to nest them. One, normal, hard, elite, e-normal, e-hard, e-elite, or zero. Close, e-elite, one, two, three, hard, one, two, three, normal, one, two, three, elite, one, two, three, hard, one, two, three, normal, one, two, three, one. Okay, good.
Okay, so that should resolve the issue for now. So it's closer. It now shows the appropriate values, but why is it showing those? I don't get that. Default pop up one, damage reduction two, oh, because it's still using the pop up in there. What? Oh, I put it in the wrong place. Got him backwards. One normal hard eat e normal e hard e elite zero dump. Cut, paste, cut, paste, cut, paste, no changes. Save page. Edit this time? No. Broke everything this time. Ah! <gasps> oh no! Okay. Try this again. Damage reduction. One, normal, hard, elite, E normal, E hard, E elite, zero, three, elite. Hard, normal, elite, hard, normal, one. Type two, one, reduces if, type two, one, all damage by one, normal, hard, elite, okay, good. If two, except from this, three, Aligned attacks. If any of those zero XP colors, those I think we got it. Yes, 
damage reduction four dash. For now, temporary fix. So now when we do show preview, up elite before epic normal good <clears throat> there is our subverted drone what's next on our list Nothing there. Necrotic Guard. Take a look at Necrotic Guard. What do we get? CR 45, Undead Zombie. Normal. Hard. Elite. E normal. E hard. Elite 45. Any DR? So slash dr. Wait a minute, why? So it says you hit necrotic guard for 28 points of pierce damage. You hit necrotic guard for three points of poison damage. You hit necrotic guard for 20 points of fire damage. You hit necrotic guard for 129 points of pierce damage after 32 were blocked by slash damage. Okay, so I'm, I'm doing double pierce, that's why. One's probably sneak attack or something. So they have DR32 slash. DR. E Elite. 32. Slash. Do, 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 do. Next. No, I don't want to delete. I want to do the next. Orum Concordian. Edit. Stone skin. XP colors. Normal. Hard. Eat. E normal. E hard. 
E Elite, 45. What else do we have here? Oh, they're in hiding in plain sight as well. So that's that for that one. What's the next one? Forum Agent? Already got that one. Any new information? Nothing. Necrotic Banker. There we go. GR. Hard. Slashing. XP colors. Normal. Hard. Elite. Normal. Hard. Elite. E Elite is 45. 43. Undead Zombie... And 32 Slash Damage Reduction. So necrotic touch I need to fix. There we go. Next. That was an interesting bug I had. Like that picture. I guess I don't have much to add to that one. That mine has a little bit of mist in the background and everybody being held.
96 DPA. Mine's probably a little bit more refined. It's a JPEG. Mine is a JPEG. Make um, Slack chat notifications go away for a little bit. So, do we think we should um, update this image to use the one at the end of the end fight with a little bit of fog and all the hell people? Having a hard time justifying it, monster wise. Ooh, first encounter with Loth. That's not accurate. That's not your first encounter. This is your first encounter. Which one's better? A or B? I think A's a little better myself. B's a little brighter, harder on the eyes. Although if I cropped it, it wouldn't be that bad. It is a better shot of her. I like this one better. I'm going to upload this one as the first encounter. So, screenshot 32. Let's see here. What's the name of the quest? Is it Spinner 
Prison, Spinner of Shadows, The Quest. Ah, The Spinner of Shadows, okay. Did an update. What happened? Control Shift R. Oh, there we go. Control Shift R. Boom. There she is. Excellent. What's this one? Records of the past. Discrete bonus? Is that what I was going for? Have the discrete bonus in there? No. So let's add it. Discrete is thirty one. Two breakables is what I found. I don't know why I double tap that one. Whatever. Okay. Wow, War Priestess 17, so that was on normal. Curtain Melarn. Curtain Melarn. Curtain Melarn is a red name. And we're actually going to crop that one. Well, it shows him as a red name. Oh. Um, well.
open it up in paint. Zoom in on Sir Curtan. Make sure we get a nice clean picture. Something like that. Save as. K-I-R-T-A-N LRN.PNG Close that. We're going to make that a PNG. I like PNGs better. Not necessarily drow. Just updating monsters. Shot in game. Screenshot. Ignore. Upload. Save. Boom! There is Sir Curtan. Why isn't he showing up as a red name? There he is. Because I used color, no. They specified color. Okay. About 15 minutes left of the stream. War Priest was not a color. Ah, we can actually add some more details to Cartan. Alright, so what do we got? We've got Polar Ray. He's got Nyax Biting Cold. He's got Ice Storm. He does pierce damage. Attack. Ice Storm. Polar Ray. Uh, what else did I say? Nyax. Piercing. What else does he have? Ball lightning. Auto Luke's freezing sphere. So he's got Auto Luke's freezing sphere. got ball lightning he's got acid ball uh, 
Acid balls, one word. What else do we got here? He can summon a Bebelith? Is that right? No. There's Acid Ball. Some Bebelis was before we got there. Okay. Yeah, see invisibility and blur. What else has he got? There's the Bebelith around the corner. Okay, so that's all that I have on him. Um, he's a drow, right? So if I bring up my client, come on, and I bring up my monster manual. I go to player races draw. Will I find Kurtan? Kurtan, he does show up in the monster manual under draw. Did you run the anniversary dungeon on that character? Um, not this year. Um, because I have the dev characters from that dungeon in my monster manual when it was said that they're not supposed to be in there. Nope, that's not right. The um, anniversary event was a special situation in which the the event monsters are in the monster manual. There are certain areas that are special situations, and that's one of them. Hmm. Ball lightning doesn't show up as a spell. We'll have to do some more research on that later. There, now you know some more stuff about him. We got seven minutes left for the stream. Let's take a look at the Bebelith. Here, Bebelith. Lapsed. 
summoned Bebelith. No picture, okay. Well, let's see here. So Bebelith has DR9 good on normal. DR normal equals 9, type equals good. What else do we have? Bebelith Venom. with Venom, what else do we have? What is that thing? I got two stacks of up there. Is that the poison? What's the the, cl the cloud then? To your resistance. So, Bimbleth poison is a minus three fort save. For now, I'm just going to screenshot that. Ah, Bibliss Stinger Venom. Save as... Beb... Bibliss... Poison.png Save Oh, it's not Venom, it's Poison Double Stinger Venom Rebel of Venom. Rebel of Stinger Venom. And Poison.
that one is poison. Good morning, Puff Granny. You made it in the last minute. Or six. What else do I have here? I think that's it. Different color, it's a stub. And I think that's it for that. We're gonna call it a stream there. Refresh this, even though there shouldn't be any change. Well, I guess I could add a picture. So let's bring up recent changes for today. Looks like we got some stuff done. Spell usefulness. Added an unsigned. Minor stuff with the templates there. K.K. Oliver's doing some work as well. Or a soldier or a magent. We did some work to template DR. Added some information on some Necro um, Bond 5 monsters. Records of the past. We had a discrete bonus. We had a Cartan Milan. We added an image and some some info we added some info on something bebelith we added some we added bebelith poison with temporary just a screenshot we added a new version of lost eminence 3 we did some stuff today thank you all for tuning in um be sure to give the channel a follow if you haven't already Give me a follow if you like like the show. Um, I should be on again next week, I believe. Oh. I don't know. Next week is up in the air. Because I have something happening on September 11th, and I don't know if I'll be back home in time. So. I will post out Monday night if I will be on next Tuesday. And then on September 26th, at the end of the month, starting with DDO Wiki Talk, I will be doing a 36-hour um, extended live stream. So make sure that you add that to your calendar. September 26th, starting at 8 a.m. Eastern with DDO Wiki Talk. Um, and then just carrying right through. Uh, make sure that you tune in and check it out. Um... Have a great week, everybody.
And I will either see you next week or I will see you on the 19th. Bye-bye.